Uh, time for some music now. Musical legend. Every sense of the word. We're about to talk to Gilbert O'Sullivan, but before we do, we have to play a few of those greatest hits. Take a look. Claire, if ever a moment so rare was captured far all to come Gilbert joins us from his home now. Welcome to the show, Gilbert. Good morning, Alison. Good morning. Uh, morning, uh, morning. Nice to be with you. It's nice for you to be with us. How are things where you are? Are you, um, are you you're currently <laughs> locked downing? Uh, we're in lockdown, the same for everybody. We're, we're doing our best to keep safe, social distancing, washing hands, uh, looking after one another. Yeah. And uh, yes, so it's much the same around and, here as it is for the rest of the country. And Gilbert, you're... Um, I mean, your work ethic, whether you're locked down or not, is, is extraordinary. I mean, you, you're up every morning writing songs all day, aren't you? When, when do you? Where do you start, for the most part, when, you're, when, you, when you sit down to write? Where does your inspiration come from? Well, the inspiration comes from, it's just the discipline of, it's a kind of brill building mentality. The brill building was a building in, in New York where people like Neil Diamond, uh, Carol King, Neil Sadaka would go in, clock in at nine o'clock, sit there in a room with a piano and try to write songs. So I have that discipline. Uh, but basically, you know, lockdown kind of suits me because I've spent most of the summer in lockdown anyway because I had to write songs for my next album. That's now done. But I still work. I still go up there. I still have songs, middle eights of songs that I'm working on constantly. So there's never a dull moment when I'm up there. And, and I, I do that five days a week and then uh, the weekend, anything but. <laughs> <laughs> and you always come up with the inspiration. Do, where do you get the inspiration from when you actually start writing do you always come up with a finished product or does sometimes you end up with nothing uh, you can end up with nothing Alison but if you've been playing the piano getting nothing it's, it's still okay because you're practicing so that that's okay but the inspiration comes with just a love of music you have to you have to love music to be able to be able to write it you, you don't get a degree in it you don't get GCEs in it it's just a love of music which translates in you being able to write songs come up with a melody if the melody is a quite serious, it will be a serious lyric, or it's more light-hearted. It's a fascinating sort of, I love this, this, the, the craft of songwriting. Well, that, that is like literally pop music, isn't it? It's literally pop music, melody, mm, chorus, yeah. bridge. That's pop music. Is that what you love writing yeah. most? <clears throat> yeah, it, it, it isn't rocket science. It, it's, that's basically it. And I, and, and I love doing it. I've never wanted to go into kind of any other area. I love the format of just trying to write those simple songs, three and a half minutes. Song. I don't want to go into kind of musicals. I like musicals, yeah. but I don't really want to go down that road. And Gilbert, do you have a favourite, or do you fall in and out of love with your own songs? Do you love some of them and then think, you know, I won't play that one for a while? Or what are the ones that have resonated with you down the years? Mm. Well, I've got, well, well touring-wise, you know, when we do we do two hour concerts, so I have a lot of favourites that I have in there. But songs will always be special. Nothing Ryan will always be special because it's the first. But then Claire will be special because it was written about. It was written as a tribute to my manager and his wife with their daughter because I used to babysit for them. So there's something very special about that song. Mm. And you're doing a lot for younger people now. What are you doing for younger people and music? I, well, if, if what can they learn from me? I mean, it's, it's basically, my, if I get, if people write to me to say, can you give me some advice? My advice would be just to, to, to be doing it for the right reasons. You wouldn't be doing it to try and make money. Uh, it's basically you do it because you love the art of what it is you're trying to do, to write a song or to sing or to make a record. That's really what it's all about. If you're successful, then things like finance will come into well, play. I feel really, just do it for the love of music. Yeah, I feel really lucky today because we, we're in for a treat. You're going to perform for us today, aren't you? Yeah, with well, this classic Nothing Rhymed, it's Gilbo Sullivan. If I give up the seed I've been saving To some elderly lady or man Am I being a good boy? Am I your pride and joy? Mother, please, if you please, say I am. And if while in the cause of my duty, oh, I perform an unfortunate take, would you punish me so unbelievably so? Never again will I make that mistake. 
mistake This feeling inside me could never deny me The right to be wrong if I choose And this pleasure I get from say Winning a bet is to lose Shandy, eating more than enough apple pies Well, I glance at my screen and see Real human beings starve to death Right in front of my eyes Nothing old, nothing new, nothing ventured Nothing gained, nothing still born or lost Nothing further than proof, nothing wilder than you Nothing older than time, nothing sweeter than wine, nothing physically, recklessly, hopelessly blind, nothing I couldn't say, nothing why cause today, nothing rhymed. Oh, 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 oh. Could never deny me the right to be wrong if I choose And this pleasure I get from say Winning a bet is to lose Nothing good, nothing bad, nothing ventured Nothing gained, nothing still born or lost Nothing further than proof, nothing wider than you Nothing older than time, nothing sweeter than wine, nothing physically, recklessly, hopelessly blind, nothing I couldn't say, nothing why, cause today, nothing rhymed. Wow. Oh, Get over. That was lovely. Thank you. Wasn't that nice? Thank you, Dermot. That was really you. nice. Really lovely. Thanks for joining us today, Gilbert. Good to be with you. Thank you. Take care. Thank safe, you. Keep well enjoyed. Enjoy Jersey. Oh.